the Tinker Tales channel if you've not been here before. Hello, I am Vicky. And uh, before we start, let me apologise for my face right now. If I look a little red to you, that is. I was at Alton Towers yesterday. The weather said it was going to be rainy and cloudy and horrible. And it was glorious sunshine and I was not prepared for that. So I've got a little bit of sunburn, but it's, it's all good. So today is Sunday the 11th of July, which means we have just one week to go until our cruise. We will be on our cruise this time next week. Or we'll be boarding or we'll be somewhere. We'll be in Liverpool somewhere about to get on our ship, I'm sure. Um, yeah, if you can't tell, I'm so excited. I'm oh, beyond excited. So I just thought I'd show you a few bits and pieces that we've bought for our cruise. Um, I have to say, before I start, this wasn't all bought for this vacation. I've been buying stuff for our cruises since like 2020 <laughs> because we were meant to be going on a cruise in 2020. So I've been picking up bits as we go. Um, there are a few things that were bought specifically for this vacation, but I, like I said, yeah, I've been waiting for a cruise for so long. <laughs> so quite a lot of this stuff was bought from small shops on Etsy, so I will link all their details down below. Please go and check them out. Let's start with these. These are my cruise ears. You've probably seen them if you've watched a few of my other vlogs. I do like wearing them a lot. I bought these before the staycations were even a thing. These were meant to be for our cruise in 2020. Um, I think I actually bought them after we pushed it back to 2021, which obviously now it's pushed back to 2022, but yeah. These are from Lottie's Laughing Place on Etsy, and I love them. So yeah, they've got a Sailor Mickey and little nice shiny red bow, but yeah, very, very cool. I'm not 100% sure if ears are a thing on a cruise. I really don't know, but I don't care. I love wearing ears, and I will be wearing them. They're, these are going to be the only ears I take on this cruise, just the one pair. But yeah, love it. Let's move on to what else you can already see, which is this jumper. This sweatshirt is from Magical Day Apparel. Like I said, I'll link them down below. And uh, yeah, it's a cruise specific sweatshirt. So it's got the lovely like rope motif Mickey here. And then I will, if I can't show this on camera, I'll put a picture in. Uh, down the arm, it's got all the ships and some little like steam Mickeys, hidden Mickeys at the top. Yeah, I love this. Um, I'm a big fan of Magical Day Apparel sweatshirts. Anyway, I've got quite a few of them now. And I actually bought this in their sale. They do quite a lot of bank holiday sales. And uh, yeah, I bought this in their May one. So can't quite remember how much it was, but I don't care. I just think ugh, they, I, I've got a few of them now. They wash well, they're comfortable. Yeah, love it. And I know it probably isn't gonna be that warm on the ship in the evenings. So I figured why not have a cruise jumper? Ah. Let's move on to some more practical things now. Uh, motion sickness tablets. I do suffer from motion sickness. Um, not on a plane, weirdly enough. Pl flying doesn't bother me, but if I'm sat in the back seat of a car or on a coach, I get quite bad motion sickness. And I've never been on a cruise ship before, but I know that when I was on the car ferry coming back from Disneyland Paris, it was very, very rough and I felt very, very ill. So uh, I'm not taking my chances. I'm going with uh, motion sickness tablets. And these were bought from Boots. I know they sell Dramamine on board, but I want to start taking them before I get there. Um, and yeah, you just have to go up to the... Uh, like pharmacy counter and ask for these. You can't just pick them up. You have to go and actually speak to someone. So yeah, motion sickness tablets. On the same note, I bought some C-bands. These came from Amazon. I think they were about five pounds for two pairs. Um, I used to use these a lot as a kid when I was uh, going on long car journeys. I always used to wear C-bands. Um, if you're not sure what they are, they're literally just like a, a cloth, a elasticated kind of cloth bracelet. And they've got um, a little bump underneath that goes on the pressure points. And they are really, really good. I used to swear by these as a kid, so thought I'd pick some up for the cruise. Another practical purchase was this. This is a travel document holder, folder thing. I'm not quite sure what to call it, but it's like a zip up pouch. And in it, it's got space to keep your passports, all your travel documents, you know, it's like credit cards, whatever you can keep in it, space for a pen. Um, I've been meaning to get one of these for a while um, and obviously this is not just for the cruise this will be for all our future trips hopefully um, and this came from Avon and I think it was about £20 but I had looked in like WH Smith and stuff and they were all way more expensive than that so when it came up in the Avon catalogue I just thought oh why not so yeah I need to kind of like personalise it a little bit I think but yeah very helpful just to have all your stuff for your holiday in one place another semi-practical purchase was these I love these. These are lanyards uh, for our key to the world card. So um, you get your card 
normally you get it when you check in but i think now you get it at your stateroom door due to covid um but these are really handy because obviously everything goes on your key to the world card you pay for shopping and all that kind of stuff on it you need it to get in and out of places it shows you where your dining is um so i thought i'd get some lanyards now if it's your second cruise or more like if you've already done one cruise you will get a lanyard given to you um if you're a silver castaway club member but this is our first cruise so i bought some lanyards and they are disney cruise themed so this one is richard's so it's really nice ribbon with like the disney cruise logo on it and this one is mine and it's got like a pirate mini head on it with the cruise logo and these came from tink's treasures so i will link all her details down below love those and from tink's treasures i also got this now this is a um ear holder or it can be used for a number of other things but um basically you can clip it onto your bag or your waistband and uh, clip your ears to it well you clip that bit onto your bag or your waistband and then your ears go in here so as if you don't want to wear them somewhere or you're just trying to keep them safe it is sunday so rich is mowing the lawn so i apologize if you can hear that but also love from tink's treasure she's got these little like mickey things on them i can't i don't know what the word is it's sunday morning i'm tired but yeah there we go how cool is that so yeah tink's treasures check her out on etsy and facebook i also bought this this is a hairband, uh, not band. I love these. I wear these quite a lot. I've got a few of them now. And it is cruise themed. So it's got a little lifesaver on there. Uh, there's an anchor. It is really, really, really cute. And this came from the Merry Ear Market. And the lovely, lovely Rachel. And she also, very kindly, I didn't buy, I bought this, but I didn't buy this. She's gifted me this little cruise kind of trinket bag which is very, very cute. It's like a drawstring bag with the uh, nice shiny cruise logo on it there. And yeah, I love this. I'm gonna use this for like, if we're going in the pool or something, I can put like my watch and my phone in it just to keep them to the side, any jewelry. But yeah, thank you very much, Rachel. Really appreciated and did not expect that at all. So yeah, love it, thank you. If you have watched lots of cruise vlogs like I do, you'll know that it's kind of a thing to decorate your door, your stateroom door with magnets now you can't stick things to your door so you can't use blue tack or cell tape or anything like that but you can put magnets on it because they're metal so everything's magnetic so i got some cruise door magnets so here is one which has got my name on it and it's got tinkerbell on it love it and here's one i did for rich lovely sort of mickey's like his favorite mickey so i thought that was cool oh it's got this one which has got my channel banner on it, which I just thought was kind of cool. Um, now these three are from Snapfish. So on Snapfish you can order photo magnets and they come in this size. So what I did was I ordered, I put the design onto the photo and then I've just cut these out using my craft knife. So I thought that worked quite well. When you look at Etsy, a lot of the magnets and stuff, it's all coming from America. So although the magnet might only be like five six dollars like then you add shipping on is like twenty dollars it just gets ridiculous for magnets so yeah i don't think these were very much i think they were like two quid each to get them from snapfish and then this one came from etsy um and this was from oh a little bird told me that was it i was, I was like i can't remember the name a little bird told me and uh, she's done ones for all the different uh staycation cruises that are going on and you can pick like where you're sailing from uh, your dates all that kind of stuff and then we've put the Tinker Tales family on just because that's my channel name so why not so yeah very very cute one last thing that I bought came from Primani and it's these these are little hand sanitizers and uh, you can kind of pop out that bit and clip them onto your waistbands or your bags uh, these were two pound each I got one for me and one for Rich I just thought they'd be really helpful just to keep to hand because I know I don't always want to be carrying a bag around me around with me on the cruise so I thought if I get these these can just go in our pockets or hooked to your waistband so we've always got access to hand sanitizer because obviously need to keep clean and healthy and all that good stuff so yeah there we go so that is it guys that is everything that i've bought leading up to our cruise apart from some new clothes for paolo and for dinners and stuff but don't need to show you all that but yeah that is it not too bad actually i don't think i think i thought i bought more but i haven't so that's good but yeah, we've got one week to go till we are boarding the Disney Magic for our two nights vacation from Liverpool. I'm beyond excited. I just, I just need some magic. I just need some Disney Magic right now because life. <laughs>
Thank you very much for watching guys. If you have enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not already and you wanna see our cruise vlogs that will be coming out very, very soon, cause there's only a week to go, then please consider subscribing to my Diddly Little channel. And don't forget to jingle that bell so you're always notified when a new vlog goes live. Don't forget to follow me on social media. Twitter is at Tinker underscore Tales and Instagram is Tinker underscore Tales 2018. Have a magical day guys and I'll see you really soon. Bye.